I don't know. That's a long trip, isn't it, Barking Guy? Yes, it is. So Barking Guy and I were talking about the Deming, trip to Deming. And if you go by Google Maps, it is four hours and eight minutes from here to there. And so that's one way. And uh, and so that's what we were talking about. You drive over, you got to set up for the broadcast, you do the broadcast, and then you got another five hour trip home. You got to stop and eat somewhere along the way. You got to get, you know, lunch. Although the Deming folks have been pretty good, they have um, uh, usually feed the press box folks. Now, the fans are going to have to, you know, go buy some stuff, but uh, the, the, uh, Press box folks, people working in the press box, they usually get uh, they get treated, and uh, so yeah, it's kind of kind of anyway. We're thinking about this. Barking guys here, and uh, uh, busy busy weekend. We had volleyball, we had Veterans Day, we had Goddard Roswell and Artesia football, we had NMMI football, we had Goddard and Artesia volleyball. Um, other teams around the area were also hard at work and uh, playing for quarters and semis and finals and so let's uh where would you like to begin we'll start with football all right in six man gateway 53 mountain air 14 congratulations to the gateway christian warriors state champs six man football gird on the heavenly armor <laughs> That's yeah because it's you can't bark you can't growl you can't screech no <laughs> And they're a Christian school, and they uh, and they're warriors. That's right. What do, I, what do I think about? I think about you know about armor. Yeah. You know, yeah. Gird on the heavenly armor of peace and hope and love. There you go. And when the co combat's ended, they'll take he'll take you up above. There you go. That's uh, that's from Sacred Heart, uh, one twenty nine heavenly armor. I know that one. Perfect. Amen. Yes. Fort Sumner House, 44. Lordsburg, 34. Congratulations to Fort Sumner House state champions, eight-man football. What did the fox say? <laughs> hey, Siri. What does the fox say? Ring, ding, 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 ding. <laughs> <laughs> well, Fort Sumner... <laughs> their their mascot is are the foxes. Okay. And house is the cowboys. Okay. But Fort Sumner uh, being a combined school, they don't officially have a mascot for the you know for their football. Well, team. then our ring ding ding ka ding sounds just fine. <laughs> yep. In two A, it was Texaco forty one, Santa Rosa twenty seven, Jal fifty three, Eunice sixteen. So Eunice finishes as a semifinalist, and Jail and Texaco go to the finals. Okay. And that'll be uh, 7 p.m. Friday night at Texaco High School. Mm-hmm. And 3A, Rui Doso, 52, West Las Vegas, 13. So Rui Doso's in the semis. 4A, Lovington, 29. By the way, that game, Riodoso at Raton. Okay. On Saturday at 1 o'clock. Okay. 4A. Lovington, 29. Portales, 23. So Lovington goes to semis. Yeah, and they'll play Silver on uh, Saturday at 1 o'clock. Yep. And skipping to 6A, Volcano Vista, 35. Hobbs, 31. So we're all done in 6A. Okay. And we'll start with the you know with the five A Deming twenty eight, Goddard thirteen. Who would have thunk it? I I was definitely surprised by that. Uh, I did not expect that outcome, but uh, I was told Deming got their quarterback back, and so they're a much better team than they were earlier in the year. And and Roswell fifty three gets to nothing, and Artesia fifty, Valley nothing. With three minutes to go in the first half. Yep. And there's so many great plays to choose from. Yep. And we'll probably have to go over on these because I have a lot. <laughs> well, that's fine. Um, Artesia and Deming will play Saturday at 1 o'clock at Deming. 
And Roswell and Piedra Vista will play Saturday at 1 o'clock at the Wool Bowl. Yes, and I and new this year with my cell phone, I can listen to the game while I'm driving to yeah. Florida. Yeah, that's right. It will use some of your data, but uh, not much if you listen. Use the radio app. I, I'm listening. Yeah. I'm using the radio app. Doesn't, doesn't use much. So that'll be, uh, that, that's going to be kind of an exciting matchup. Um, for sure, we're doing radio for both games. That's, that's a given. Uh, the question is the video. And so I, yeah. have, I have put in a request to the New Mexico Activities Association to purchase the video streaming rights for f Saturday's Roswell game with Piedra Vista, since that's the team we cover anyway is Roswell High, and it's on our home turf. But I have not yet heard whether we've been granted the opportunity to purchase those rights. And then Deming Artesia, I've got to speak with their uh, their folks first and get some get some um, information, if you will. <laughs> we'll yeah, get, we'll get that squared away. But uh, Artesia Deming will be here on the radio, 9:90 a.m., 93.7 f.m. And uh, Piedra Vista Roswell will be on 106.5 Roswell's Talk FM. I had a call. I get, you know, if you call and leave a message for me, it goes to a, a, a voicemail that gets yeah. emailed to me. So I get this email last night with a voice message about 9 o'clock last night. And I play it. What are you doing? Where's Clyde Lewis? I want to hear Clyde Lewis. What's going on with you people? Come on. Click. And I thought, well, Clyde Lewis isn't on on Sundays. This is Sunday night. I wonder if this guy thinks it's Monday night and not Sunday night. So I called him back. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I, I just now, I was at the gun show all day. I just realized that it was, it was Sunday night and it's Bill Cunningham. I don't care for Bill Cunningham, but I, I, I got to have my Clyde Lewis, and I apologize. I'm so sorry. And I'm thinking to myself, well, where was the phone call message with the apology? <laughs> the only thing I heard was the screaming and yelling that we were. Anyway, we'll be back with more on the other side.